Yo, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy here, Sean, and I'm going to McDonald's right now. It's like 8.50 in the morning. Me and my friends, they just like, they just asked to go. So I was like, why not? So on the way on the way there, we're going to talk about what we're going to do with the channel, what the schedule is going to be, and what's, what's this right here. So I'll show you there in a minute. So what's this channel got it in store for? Gonna have big gaming videos. Gonna have big vlogs. The game videos gonna be nice too. They're gonna be funny. Have funny editing on. Then gonna have me in them. So trying not to be a dub. You feel me? So there's a bunch of gotta talk about the gaming. First thing I'm gonna talk about is we gonna play. Kind of said this in one of my gameplays that I ain't upload yet because I've been lazy and I ain't wanna upload them. But. One of the gameplay says that we're going to do a story game, then we're going to do a fun game. And then we're going to have to do like a 2K or Madden, a video like every day. I'm going to try to. That does not have a story game or that fun game I was playing. So I'm trying to, I'm trying to be part of every genre. Because you see, look on YouTube, right? I don't think there's anybody that's like that, you feel me? I guess you don't feel me because I'm talking to you through screen. But what I'm saying is that like... I don't know any YouTubers that are like doing every single thing. So I'm gonna be the first. I'm gonna be the best at it too. Um, I think that might be all for gaming. But just 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 wait. I'm trying to I'm just growing. I got stuff to do too. And yeah, that's it for the gaming portion. So now we're on the vlogging portion. And I'm trying to do the vlogs every one week. And also it's gonna have my life in it, obviously. Also, other people, like my family, my friends, and all that. And I think it'd be cool for y'all to know what's going on in my life and document it, basically. I think that'd be really dope. And also, what did I say? Also, I forgot. I recorded this before, too. I just recorded this, and it didn't record. Um... I don't know, but yeah, all it is really is just me doing my same thing, doing my thing. It's going to be funny, and I can't wait to see what happens. So I'm finally at McDonald's. Um, also, I wanted to say I want to document my path to greatness. Ooh. I'm documenting my path to greatness because I'm going to be great. You already know who I am, but... I'm at McDonald's. I'm gonna grab up with some pancakes. And I don't know what I'm gonna do from that. So we were balling. Now, now it's the ball. So after balling, the brothers, I got sick. Threw up twice. You could confirm a loot, right? Yep. I'm not having a great day. I got smacked in the jaw twice. Messed up his braces. And now, threw up twice. Andrew's legs hurt. It's because he's just a fat dude. That's why. But, this is bad. See what my boy was eating? Show, show him, Andrew. Show him, Andrew. Look at that. That's it's nasty. Good. It's a taco. It's a mini taco. With vegetables. In the hot sun. No. It was in the oven. Andrew, it's hot in the oven. But he's, he's foul for that. He's foul for that. So, we left Luce's house. I told you, I threw up a couple times. We down, went down to the wreck. This dude, Andrew, got sunburn on his head. It happened. He looks like the red skull or something. But, um, what was that? Recap of the day, I guess. It's only 4 o'clock, actually. So, it's like the day's still, I guess, out We're there. Out from like 8 all the way to 4. Like 30 something. And you can tell from the. So we're still outside, so it's probably gonna be till 5. You can probably tell from the video that, like, you could tell that the time changed from the beginning to the end. I feel much better now. I busted on him on basketball. I busted on this dude. And he was on the ground and all that. That's why I look at him. Look at him now. That isn't even true. I bust out on him. But there ain't much to say right now. We just walking home. My feet hurt. They're killing me. I can't wait to get home. 
laid down. My mom's bringing me some pickles. I, I don't know why. I just want some pickles right now. And that's going to be the end of the day. This is the end of vlog. Thank y'all for watching. There's nothing for me to say because there's nothing going to be doing at night. Except playing games. That's all, really. Got myself something to eat. That's something, something to drink. So, yeah. I'll see y'all next time I do this. Peace. So, it's early in the morning. And they got the pickles, at least. So, I guess that's a dub for the morning. So, this is the next day after I got the pickles. I got to mow the lawn with an old lawnmower. But... I hate doing this. Well, I hate doing chores and just in general. Got this heavy, hot jacket on. It's like 80 degrees outside. I'm trying to finish this so I can go to the park, play basketball. But um, what I was gonna say? I was gonna say, even though I hate this chore a lot, I don't get to listen to music all day. Just like think about stuff while listening to music. And the thing about that is like, I don't know. I'm listening to Flower Boy, Tyler the Creator album. People said that album was album of the year for. <coughs> <coughs> Thank you. Um, people said that album was album of the year for 2017. <coughs> Dang. But um, people said that that was album of the year for 2017. I don't I don't hear it. I don't know why people have the like love. I don't know. I don't know why people like Tyler the Creator are like that. Like his music is dope. Some of his songs are dope, but I don't see any of his albums as a classic or like somebody really dope. But that's just my opinion. Yeah, I'm gonna finish this. I'm gonna finish this long. I'll talk to y'all later in a minute. All right. See. <coughs> see. So I finished the backyard. Now I gotta do the front yard. Front yard. I don't even. It's so big. And the thing is that I got this heavy jacket on again, and I got wires. And it's like, bro, I wish I had my AirPod case. I have the AirPods. It's not the case. I left it at this person's house. I ain't ever going to get it probably back. Or well, I probably am, but it's going to take. It's a struggle. It's been a real struggle with wires. And I may sound spoiled and all that saying that, but I'm just saying, just like, these wires are a struggle. Yeah, I'm gonna catch you back when I finish the front yard, the front lawn, and I'll be telling you how I feel about that Flower Boy album. Cause right now I ain't vibing with it. So I finished the backyard and the front yard. Now I gotta clean the dishes real quick, freshen up, and I'm about to skedaddle to the park. So I'll see you there so, again. Listen to Flower Boy. And Flower Boy ain't the boy for me. But back to what I was saying about Flower Boy. I don't know. I don't mess with it too much. Maybe it's because, maybe, I don't know. I just don't like the sounds that I'm getting from it or whatever. Whatever that really means. But I'm on my way to the park first. I got to get freshened up. Then after I get freshened up, I got to walk down there. It's like 80 some degrees outside and it's hot. Got my favorite, one well, of my favorite shoes on. But I got one of my favorite shoes on. But I'm not gonna play in them. Pay them my favorite, one of my favorite shoes. I got other shoes in my book bag. This green bag right here. It's, bro, it's so hot and I'm going up a hill. Just cut the lawn. But I don't have any shoes really to hoop in. Hold up, yeah, I went to the dog passes. So, oh yeah, back to what I was saying, because the dogs interrupted me. I have my shoes in the back of my book bag, two mismatched pair, because honestly, I think it's cool looking, but also, I don't, I don't have them no more. Like, one pair got stuck in the mud, and it ain't ever coming out. Then, the other pair, I think I lost it. The thing is that they're both two different sizes. The one in my book bag is a ten and a half. The one I have, like the one I'm wearing, I have to wear it. All right. The left pair is eleven and a half, a ten and a half. The right pair is a eight and a half. 
and I wear like an 11 to 11 and a half. So it's like, and there's a hole in the bottom of them. So my big toe always get exposed and it makes a hole in my sock. It's a tragedy, but I don't know, I just gotta live with it. Not today, go for my application next week. Taking my driver's test so I can get my permit. So hopefully this month looking good for me. Also, oh yeah, wanted to talk about since Tyler the Creator ain't really my boy. Well, like his song, some songs is dope, but then some other songs they're like, bro, I don't mess with it. Like his albums, I don't really mess with them, except for some songs, right? But one person, I know there's a couple people, but the two people that are like kind of low key but not really not. My boy Saba. Saba is a is a. I don't even can't even describe him. That boy is so fire. And somebody even more fire than him. He's got more popular now. JID. JID is so fire. Like, can't explain how fire he is. He that he just that fire. Just the way that his voice. Just could just like he got a high voice, but that's the thing. It's like makes him more unique and different than everybody else. Also, he kind of reminds you of a little bit of Kendrick when he goes into that voice. Also, he can sing a little bit. He can sing for sure, actually. And he got, he already got a classic in The Never Story. That album is so fire. And then DiCaprio 2 is still fire, too. That's more of his, like, more popular one. DiCaprio 2 is still fire. My, my second vinyl is going to be The Never Story. My first one is going to be For Your Eyes Only. But the second one for sure is going to be The Never Story. Because that album is so fire. All right. So, it's the next day again. And today's going to be a short one because I'm not really going to do anything that much, really. Um, I'm just going to Brooklyn again. Dang, the wind. I just, have, I just took a shower. Got a big old knot in my head. Like, hair knot. But, so. But everything's going bad. Everything. I'm telling you. Back. So, I'm going to Brooklyn real quick. We're going, I'm going to hoop there. Not even for long, just for a little bit. Then I'm going to go home and do the same old, same old. So today, it's going to be something quick and something boring. Tomorrow, no, not tomorrow. Wednesday, I might have something good for that day. But that's a big maybe because I need cash and I don't have the cash. And the people I'm going with, I mess with them a little bit, but I don't know. I don't know. So you just got to wait until then. All right. See you. So came back from the wreck. It's 80. It feels the like 87. That's what the weather said. It feels the like 87 degrees outside, yo. It's way too hot to be outside to not be in the pool. So we hooped up for a little bit. But then I had, like, we all did. I was fine with playing, but I was kind of low-key happy that we didn't play no more. Because, dang, it is extremely hot. So I'm almost home. It took me, like, 40 minutes. I had a Slurpee at 7-Eleven. And I'm telling you right now, yo, that Slurpee was the worst thing I ever had. Might have been. It just, it just was good at that moment, but, like, it was so sour and liquidy. It just didn't look right. So I'm coming home now. I'm going to just chill. It's probably, probably going to be the end of the vlog for today. So next, but for real, I got y'all soon with, like, some crazy stuff. Don't even worry. I'm sorry that it's been nothing. If I got you with crazy stuff, so just wait. <clears throat> oh, today is the next day. And RIP my man, Etika. He died. Apparently, he committed suicide. He said he would die in Brooklyn. I'm pretty sure he died in Brooklyn. So, man, I just, it's been just weird to think about that the dude died. The dude was always, not always positive, but he, he spoke his mind for sure. For sure he spoke his mind. But also he just like, I don't know. He kind of, it was just like funny all the time. 
always bring energy. The other dude is gone. Because, I don't know. But, I've been watching him since I was little. I remember, have, like, hiding it from my parents. Well, from my mom. Because, he was, he was inappropriate for sure when I was little. Even now, too, but, man, it just, it's just hard to think about. This man really died. It's just like, the hard part is that, like, he committed suicide. That's the hard part. It's just like, dude really died jumping off the bridge. And, like, the thing is, I had hope that maybe he just wanted to get away. Maybe he just wanted to leave social media. That's why he just left his switch and everything. And now he just gone. But, no, he really is gone. But, it's fine. Well, it's not fine, but it's like, I don't know. It's kind of hard. Even the most positive people, or just like the look of it, you could always say, forget all those people and just say like, all this stuff, all this stuff. But no matter what, it's going to get to you eventually. Like, just hearing it over and over and over, even though you're the most positive person, you're still going to get affected by it eventually but YouTube would definitely miss him cause my boy he the joy con boy I'm a joy con boy joy con man I'm gonna get popular for him so it's probably gonna be it for today but RIP my man Etika and joy con boys joy con men out here I just wanted to say again since there was nothing to do, all I did today really was nothing. But I just want to say again, RIP, Etika, I wish that you would have got the help that you needed. Mental illness is a hard thing to talk about too. Because you don't really know what the person needs or whatever. And it's kind of hard to see me, you know, because like I'm, you know, the color I am. But like, yeah, RIP, my man, Etika. All those people that were saying he was a clown, and I was saying RIP. For the people that didn't believe them, now they're doing all that. It's like, maybe if they would've never said that was clown stuff, maybe it would be better. Maybe, honestly, look, I'm a Christian, right? But the thing is that we do edit was talking about God type of stuff and whatever. And I'm just like, all right, I'm cool with that. I still hope he makes it to heaven and all that. Also, I just, I just hope that he was going to be fine. He could do what he wants, right? He could, he could believe what he believes. But I ain't calling them about it. But all these other people was calling them about it. And I'm just like, man. Maybe maybe those clowns, all those clown emojis that always happen, just kept on going and going to make them to that point where you just had to jump. But this vlog is going on until the week, the whole entire week, until I think Saturday or something like that. I don't remember, but yeah, that's it for today. Today was just a sad day. I, don't, I never want to see any person die. But see y'all, see y'all the next day, I guess. So this is, I think, think there's like two, one more day before the end of the vlog officially. Um, also, this is the next day of Etika's death. I P him again. But moving on to like more happy, fun stuff and all that. I wanted to talk about, well, I'm going up to the store. My brother wants a Snickers. And I want, uh, what's it called? I want a, I don't know what I want. But okay. what I want to, so, like, my favorite rapper, one of my favorite rappers of all the time is my boy Kyle, K-I-D, Super Duper Kyle, Kyle K-Y-L-E. Now, it, it's a really weird, strange favorite rapper in a way. Cause like when I talk to all my friends about it, they're like, what, Kyle? But I'm like, yeah, Kyle, Kyle just, he's like so happy. In a time where everybody's always so sad, always looking on the negative, he's always there on the positive. But at the same time, right? He's always, on his music, he's always positive. Behind his new album, what's it called, The Light of Mine? It had a little bit of like, he's always happy, but he dropped an album that wasn't, so happy all the time, you know, you understand, I don't know, but like, 
dude talked about a lot of like I believe he talked a lot about about the brain, about about what he thinks and all that. But also he just fire. He just he's he's more relatable to me than a lot of other rappers. Cause a lot of other rappers like Travis Scott, that dude's out there. And like Uzi, they do they're out there, right? They doing their own thing. Doing crazy stuff. But like, or you could be like Cole Kendrick. Cole and Kendrick, I don't have the past like Cole and Kendrick. But then Kyle is like Kyle. I feel like I don't know much about Kyle's past, but like, he looked like he came up just normally. That's why I'm about to do the same thing. And also with Kyle, just like Kyle, he just he just a weird looking, funny dude. But man, I don't want to ask my favorite rappers. So do nothing to vlog today. Well, I guess yesterday, technically. Now it's today at 1 o'clock. And my boy, finally, Chancellor Bennett, Chance the Rapper, finally dropped Acid Rap in 10 days on album music. Boy, it's been years. Those are mixtapes. And they finally on album music. Juice is not on it, though. But I could work my way onto it. But dang, Chance the Rapper, Alexa, play Palm Night. Alexa. Ale yeah, I don't have an Alexa. But I got another option. Ten day tapes in my number. Don't call it impossible. If you really want that, they sent me to summer school. Don't oh my bro, this song is so fire. It is so fire, this song. But I don't want to play too much because I don't know if there's copyright on it. This boy, Pusha. Man, by Chance the Rapper, it's so f it is so fire. Look, just listen to it. I gotta stand up for this too. <laughs> Ten days, and now that I gotta do this, just and so and roll rage. Listen, ah. oh wait, I do do little tactics. Oh my bro, bro, no joy. No joy, we toe tagging. Oh my, look. Chance the Rapper is such a fire person. People just never gave him chances, I feel like. Because they had to go out the way to listen to him. Because the only album that used to be on it was Coloring Book. But guess what? Now there's all of them. <coughs> my those giant. Now there's all of them. And now everybody gets to experience this. I wish. I wish I could just go back and listen to him the first time I ever listened to him. Like, I listened to him the first, the first year of high school, which was like two years ago. That was the first time I ever listened to them. And man, they're so fire. I remember listening to them on my little LG. My LG that was like black ink or whatever inside of them for no, I don't know why. But it was just, just there with the black ink. With some wireless headphones I found on the street. Yeah. They were on the street. And I was just like, man, I might as well just snatch them. And I got a little toothpick. I just cleaned them out. And I was like, good as new, basically. And also, like, I got a new little rubber thing. Because I don't want no ear disease. But I remember I used to listen to them. Oh, my. Bro, this it's just so fire. So fire. Now he released it. Man, it's, it's just so fire. It's just so straight heat. Straight heat, boy. But on another topic, I wanted to talk about what's it called? How did it, how am I going to do this vlogging thing? Because at first, when I thought about it, I was going to go day by day. But I realized my days are kind of short. And I don't vlog much. I think I need to vlog more to go day by day. But I'm going to go weekly. Or like, yeah, like weekly. I'm going to try to go Monday through Sunday, but I started on Saturday. So today, which is Friday, is going to be the last day of, of this episode of the vlog, part one. And almost already, I basically have episode one already, uh, what's it called, freaking uploaded. All I need to do is, hold up, before I continue, I'm not going to edit this out either. I don't know, what should I look at? Should I look at myself, like right there? Or should I just look at the camera? I'm going to just look at the camera. It's just because I don't know. I just look at the camera. 
I think I should look at the camera. But that was weird right there. But I'm gonna go weekly, and that's probably gonna be my game plan tomorrow, or which was which is today, kind of. I'm going over my boy's house, my boy Lucha's house. Early in the vlog, uh, we played at basketball. But I'm gonna try to vlog more that day. It's gonna be 89 and 90 degrees, boy. It's gonna be hot. It's life. But I'm going to try to vlog more at the place. His house is crazy, like crazy. Like I live in a small apartment. That boy looks a little bit like a hotel mansion type stuff. But I'm gonna vlog at his place. It's probably gonna be dope and fun. And hopefully the vlogs are around like 20 minutes long. I don't want it to be too long because I feel like all I'm doing, I realize like, I realize what I'm doing. I feel like I'm just sitting here and talking. You know what I mean? Like I'm not even walking around and vlogging. Kind of just, I'm sitting down there, I'm talking and I'm talking about what I'm thinking about. I like walking around a little bit, but it's not crazy. Because I'm not, I don't live in a crazy place. I live in Pittsburgh and, I, and Beachview. Beachview just has a bunch of old buildings. That's why it's just, like, not even that crazy. When I go to Brookline, I might vlog more. But for now, this is all there is. But, yeah. Good night, y'all. I'm about to get, catch some Z's. Listen to 10-Day Acid Rap. And before I continue, hopefully, this is my game plan. I'm probably going to have to talk about it later, too, when I grow up, blow up a little more. When I get my own place. Not my own place. Like, my own room. Because we have, live in a two-bedroom apartment. When I get my own place, yo. My own room. My room is going to fill with vinyls. My first ever vinyl is going to be that Chance the Rapper. He's not even my favorite rapper. My favorite artist. I'm going to have a Chance the Rapper acid rap vinyl in my room behind me. It's going to be so fire. But yeah, that's all I wanted to say. Good night, y'all. And peace out. What up, YouTube? It's a man right here, son. I think I got allergies in my nose and stuff, yeah, but it's going to be the end of the vlog um, for this week or whatever. And I'm actually getting ready to record gameplay three videos today, three game videos, upload them every day so I can just get a break day a couple times. But yeah, I just wanted to close it off and basically peace. So thank y'all for watching. Hit the like button, subscribe, share with your friends and all that. And thank you. Peace.